All right, we've got our first official big find of the season. Brad Keselowski is fined by NASCAR from modifying a part. Coming up next. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? If I haven't earned your subscription, hopefully today is the day I will earn that subscription. All right, Brad Keselowski just got fined 100 points, fined $100,000. Crew Chief Matt McCall is suspended for four races, and if he makes the playoffs, he is docked 10 playoff points when he makes the playoffs. Brad Keselowski was currently sitting 16th in points. The 100-point deduction will take him to 22 points. That'll put him 36th, just uh, around where Garrett Smithley is at, just below Garrett Smithley right now. He would be 99 points out of the playoffs now as it bumps Austin Sendrick with 121 points into the last man in in the playoffs as it stands right now. So... Now, we know earlier in the season, RFK, Brad Keselowski, was caught uh, modifying the wheels. They said it was for safety. So this is not their first uh, sort, of, sort of modifying a manufacturer, a single manufacturer part here. Uh, that one was deemed as a safety deal. Them and Penske were both caught doing it, and apparently NASCAR agreed with them at that time. This time, however, NASCAR is taking a much harder line, it looks like. So let's talk about the money first off. The money, $100,000, that is nothing to sneeze at. Uh, but for some of these bigger teams, I don't think that will deter them going forward. But the 100-point fine, the 100-point fine, I think this is what's going to get the team's attention. This has basically taken him out of the playoffs, and he is going to have a monumental task in front of him to get back into playoff contention without getting a win. Like, obviously, if he gets a win, he's locked in, but also the 10 bonus points are knocked out, too. So that is basically uh, 10 stage wins or uh, one actual win. So even if he wins his way into the playoffs, it is null and void. It would be just like if he pointed his way in because those 10 playoff points are gone. Uh, now, obviously, as I said, is RFK modifying more parts than that? Because uh, like I mentioned earlier, the wheel was modified earlier in the season. NASCAR let it let that one go. But this time, I think they're taking a harder line because of that wheel. I think they might have even been looking harder at the RFK and Penske cars because of the modification to that wheel. Because you know how NASCAR is. Once they see you doing a little something they don't like, they're really going to focus in on you and look harder at the stuff you're doing from there on out. Because I think... NASCAR might have felt like, all right, well, you got, got away with one here, so we're going to make sure everything on that car to make sure you don't get, get away with another one. So I think they were probably targeted, uh, to be totally honest, but that's just my opinion. I, there's nothing I can really base that on just other than past experience. Uh, like if NASCAR, you know, doesn't like you or doesn't like something you did, they're going to make sure they get you. Uh, sort of like, you know, in life. If somebody doesn't like you, they're going to go out of their way uh, to get you. I think that was a sm at least a small part of what happened here. Uh, but the other thing I wanted to mention is going forward, you know they're going to, going to appeal this. Uh, you know, they're going to appeal the four-race suspension from Matt McCall, and they're going to appeal this because they want those points back and they don't want to spend that money. But I don't think there's any way, I don't think there's any chance that they get away uh, with uh, the appeal. I think NASCAR is going to stand firm here because I think NASCAR, this is the first team that really got caught, right, with something big, modifying a manufactured part. So I think NASCAR for sure is going to stick it to them and make sure that this, this uh, stands, this penalty stands because they want to deter all these other teams from modifying stuff uh, going forward. Will it deter these other teams? Probably not. Everybody's going to keep doing uh, what they've been doing in the past, probably until they get caught. But I think they're going to use Brad Keselowski and RFK Racing as an example here. So I think he is sort of stuck with this penalty, and uh, he's going to have to race really hard, really clean, and make up 99 points to get back into the playoffs. All right, this was breaking. I wanted to get it out here. Uh, hopefully this thing uploads pretty quick and that's uh, if you like the content feel free to subscribe down below uh, If you got a comment leave it down in the comment section I'd love to know what you guys what you guys take is on this issue and uh, other than that. Thanks for your time Peace